Psalm 92, verse 12. The righteous shall flourish like the palm tree. He shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Praise the Lord. Um, here, God is describing a righteous man or someone who has been justified by God as a tree. Now, again, we need to understand something that the Bible is actually written, is actually spiritual words or spirit written in words. Jesus Christ said it this way. He said that uh, the words that I speak to you, they are spirit and they are life. Hallelujah. So when we're reading uh, scriptures or we're reading from the Bible, I want us to have it in our hearts that we're actually uh, encountering spirits. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So here it says that the righteous shall flourish like the palm tree. So here God is... Um, using the palm tree to describe a righteous man now the second part of this verse is telling us that he shall grow like a cedar in lebanon praise the lord now uh, a tree is a living thing uh, the only difference between a tree and an animal or other living beings is that it does not move uh, it doesn't shift. It doesn't move from one location to the other. Rather, it grows upwards. That's why when God is trying to describe um, either himself, our Lord Jesus, or he's trying to describe um, a believer, he, he uses the terminology of a tree. For example, in the book of Genesis, he talked about the tree of life. So it means that it's a tree, but it's not just any kind of tree, but it's a living tree or it's a tree of life. But here it's telling us that, that the righteous man shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Now the interesting thing is this, that these cedars, the cedars of Lebanon, they don't grow anywhere else in the world. God is awesome. It, they only grow in Lebanon. They only grow in that part of the world, which means that the environment, the geographical environment, the soil content, the minerals and whatever it is in the soil and the air in that area is the only one that has been approved by God Almighty to, um, to help nourish uh, such trees. Uh, those trees, they live like almost forever. Some of them, 2,000 years or more. One tree <laughs> is alive, doesn't die. Stays on and on and on for over a thousand years, sometimes 2,000 or maybe even three if I'm, if, I'm, if, I'm, if I'm correct. Praise the Lord. And they grow so tall. They grow so tall, so many uh, feet into the sky. Um, that's what god is using to describe you my brother my sister that you are like a tree you are like the cedar in lebanon very tall very strong and endures hallelujah praise the lord if you look at Psalm 1, it says, Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor seated in the way of sinners, nor seated in the seat of the scornful. But in the law of the Lord does he meditate day and night. And it says here that he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, and that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. His leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. So you see here, God is using a tree to describe a believer so <laughs> my brother my sister continue to grow make sure you are planted by the river